Hey everybody, welcome to another Elevation Games stream. Um, today we are sharing a special uh, sneak preview with you uh, of Bellows Intense, uh, an age contrived. Um, we are playtesting this uh, for the designer and uh, we're going to play through a quick game here for everyone. Uh, first, I'm going to read the intro here so you know what this game is all about. Um, for a thousand years, you and the other gods of your kind have ruled over Eldranir, a mortal world of disparate clans and untapped potential. And whatever you might think of them, you need the mortals, for it is only their belief in you that gives you your power. Now an inflection point emerges in the history of Eldranir, precipitated by events that you set in motion. The mortal clans are on the cusp of uniting, bringing stability to Eldranir after centuries of strife. Steer the new mortal order into reliance on the Pantheon as, you're in, as you engineer the formation of a civilization. Solidify your legacy among mortals and you can lead the Pantheon and the mortal realm in a new age of your own making. An age contrived. In an age contrived, each player takes on the role of a god in the Eldronic Pantheon deriving their power from the belief of mortals. Players support mortal development through monuments, pillars of civilization, and other lasting achievements. The goal is to have the most victory points representing mortal belief in your god. All VP are scored at the end of the game based on how you have placed your energy tokens on the board. Players take their turn in clockwise order with no rounds or phases. The game ends when the last monument is completed, at which point subsequent players take one final turn if necessary until all players have had an equal number of turn. Uh, video tutorials, resources, lore, and support available at bellowsintent.com slash agecontrived. Um, so, if you are curious, uh, you can check that out there as well. Um, I'm going to switch this real quick so you can get a view of uh, the board itself. Do a quick little side view there. So... The hook on this game is, you may see these pieces of metal sticking up, we're going to be building monuments as we go. Um, and as usual, I am joined by my lovely wife, Wendy, and my stupid looking brother, Daniel. That's funny to say since y'all look alike. I mean... I... <laughs> Here, I'll, I'll take that. <laughs> he said it. I just in case it. we need a rule check, I'm going to just keep this uh, right here. Because we are still um, learning how to play this. We are not experts by any measure. so Not at all. <laughs> um, okay. We have played, few, played through it a few times at this point, so though. So hopefully um, we won't mess anything up too terribly. <laughs> so do we want to say the characters that we are playing? Sure. I'll go first. Yeah. I'm actually playing two-handed um, tonight for the first time. Uh, we'll see how this goes. I may have to abandon one. I don't know. We'll find out. Um, but I am playing Rujni, the Bulwark, and I am playing uh, Multinek, the Crafter. So two, I'll, each of the characters are like really different with the way that they play and the benefits that they have. So, Is that a broccoli knight? It's a broccoli night. Okay, um, cool. Mm -hmm. <laughs> he has a he has a lovely tree coming out of his head. Ah. Okay. And then Daniel, who who are you playing? I am a bird. Uh, <laughs> named Arion. Ar mm -hmm. Arion. Um, the traveler. Yeah, he is all about moving. It seems. Uh, he he's hustling. That's the name. <laughs> uh, and I am playing Ignotus, uh, dragon. Uh, he is the keeper, obviously, of his horde. <laughs> um, Let's choose who goes first. Okay. I'm actually going to put two fingers on here. Because I have two characters. Unfair advantage. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Rujni is going to go first. I think she programs her phone to do that. 
Mm-hmm. It's funny that you say that, Daniel, because normally Schwazi picks Jeremy, and I'm always just like, Schwazi loves you. I don't know why we even pretend. So we're going to um, start here. We've got these uh, energy tokens on our player boards, um, and we're going to distribute those onto our um, transmutation devices here. Uh, those will determine when we can uh, do actions. That's right. Yeah, maybe we should just leave the camera where it's at. Although, can I have one of those to use as my um, action device? No, like one of oh, the tiles? Oh, oh, yeah. Yep, of course. Okay, thank you. So, uh, this is a prototype. Uh, we picked it up at Shucks and came home and we're missing, of all of the components on this game, we were missing only one component. And it is this action token. I don't even know if you can see it on the screen. <laughs> so I just use um, a little 3D printed Gloomhaven tile as my uh, action token. So, um, Okay, so I am going to load up my boards. Yeah, first thing we should do is load up our boards. Huh? Oh, yeah. Um... So uh, the first three... Anyway. Yes. <laughs> what? I'm a little too good at being random about the tiles that I put into the bank over here. Oh, yeah. Um, because every single time I pull for myself, it looks like I hate myself. But when I pulled for y'all, <laughs> I do a good job with it. So that's why I didn't pull anybody's today except for my own. Because <laughs> I really like shot myself in the foot with these guys. Um, we should also flip these, uh, our little reward oh, yeah. tokens here. So what do you have? Um, so on this monument down here, it's a upgraded action tile. Uh. Um, this one is a, um... Conduit? Conduit token. So I've got, uh, you can put your tile down. Okay. And then on the furnace, you can move four spaces. Oh, of course, Daniel got the weird one. <laughs> Uh, it lets you replenish, replenish one of your transmuter tile. That's right. Yeah. So that means yeah. load it up with energy. Yep. Okay. That's right. Yep. yep. Okay. Got it. Got it. Got it. Okay. So, uh, Rujni, what are we going to do with you? Um, I am going to spin that to go ahead and activate here. And then I am going to exhaust this energy here so as to place this compass and I'm going to place it here on the furnace and that is all um, that Rujni is going to do oh hmm. it is it's upside down Daniel's right I need to flip that over what is the mean? tower yeah you can't see the uh Oh, 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 I see, I see, I see. Okay, Okay, so with Multinec, I am going to just advance. Okay, Daniel, it's your turn. Yeah. So, three lets me use these two. This one lets me use these two. This lets me buy new. Um, okay. And if we charge this, you can advance for two the next time you take an advance action. Right. 
But that's all I can do this turn if I do that. Correct. It's either or. No. Uh, no, you can you can charge that mm-hmm. as one of your movements from the first uh, from the first um, transmitter on your device. Right. But okay. But, but then, then I would able to, to do the it. other stuff too. Yeah, you still yeah, yeah, you can yeah, yeah. use any energy as long as you've got energy to do it. You can do it. Yeah. You just can't on this one. On this one, you have to choose to either place or charge. Right. On that right, particular right. action tile. Yep. Got it. Okay, it's coming back to me. So we're gonna do that, and then we're gonna use this to. These. I'm gonna put this guy here, and this guy. Where did you get two from? Oh right, we can only do one. See, if you you exhaust the energy back into your pool, and then you can place one or the other. Right, first and it needs know. to be this one, anyways. Um, I'm remembering. There's um, rules to remember. Like. Well, I'm, I'm remembering when um, we get upgraded versions of these later in the mm, game, mm-hmm. you can do two. Mm-hmm. So, all right, we're good. Okay. Um, I am also going to charge my sigil. What is this thing called again? I was just looking at that. Uh, your channel marker. My channel marker. Um, that's why I can't remember it because it sounds like a something you would use on my TV. <laughs> um, and then I'm going to exhaust this to place this guy. Um, and then I'm going to exhaust this. To purchase this upgraded tile, and he's going to replace this one. Okay. All right. Back around to Mr. Broccoli. Okay, so Mr. Broccoli is going to have a big turn here. Uh, he's going to exhaust his uh, channel marker. <laughs> it just left me. Okay, channel marker and advance for two on my device here. Replace these tiles with new ones. Big turn, big turn. Um, and then, let me get these populated. And then this guy. I will say, if you are thinking about backing this, one of the upgrade options they offer is a metal holder for these transmutation devices so rad um <laughs> that make i mean they're basically big uh conveyor belts um it makes them feel even more like that as you slide things in the others just come out the end um and whenever you want to eject uh energy tile i'm i'm using that term intentionally because you flip a little switch and it literally <laughs> pops it out <laughs> Okay. I don't know how much those are going to be. We don't know pricing on any of this yet, but uh, it was very cool to see those. And then I am also going to... Put a towel on my track here. All right. And that's going to be it for me. So we have filled up um, the first... Yes. Uh, First stack on that monument there. (laughs) 
on the beacon. Mm-hmm. Uh, so Daniel, uh, it's going clockwise from the person who finished it. So Daniel first. Uh, you can either take um, a conduit, a conduit up there, or you can take a compass and a rock from your reserve. Might want to grab one of them compasses. <laughs> yeah. And how much did my Tennessee just show up? Grab one of them compasses. <laughs> <laughs> I know what you're talking about, Teeter. But I do want the double feet. Want the double feet. Okay. There you go. Thank you. And I just put this anywhere. Mm hmm. But you can't move it once it's there. So make sure. Um, well, I mean, so. When a when feet come into here, yeah, it activates. Yeah. Does it activate if it goes boom boom? Nope. nope. Oh, so it has to land. Yep. Okay. But I get to choose what order these go into. Correct. Okay. And you get this back. Uh, you you haven't unlocked your abilities yet, so I don't think that does anything for you yet. No. Um, I, I'm going to take the, uh, as you like to call them, Disney World one, please. <laughs> Thank you. Okay. Um, and this guy snaps back in here. Um, and now you get to choose, huh? Yes. Um, I am going to take the sentient track. Yes, I'm going to take the sentient track. Okay. And this gets bound. Oh. Wait, will you flip the camera? On? Yeah. So that we can see that go up? Yeah. So this is the first piece of this of the beacon monument going up. Yeah, and these are ma these are magnetic, so they snap into place. Okay, so now with four people playing, you have a scenario where one person didn't get anything out of that. That's interesting. You yep. always can have that scenario. True. True. <laughs> But yes, uh, there will be at least one person on each one of these because as you go down, you have fewer yeah. places um, to place your energy. Mm -hmm. That's interesting. Okay. <laughs> it's like the quake symbol almost. Kind of. Okay. Um, so okay. Daniel, it's your turn. Uh, well, I'm going to exhaust my thing to Bob. And... Uh, that's the official term. By the way. Advance <laughs> this to and do this, which means I get to move two, right? Three. Oh. Yeah, it's all the symbols that are lined up. Oh, okay, I see. Um, first, let's do this. Too far. Yeah, I was gonna say you are effectively stuck right now. <laughs> Three. All right. Okay. I also am going to exhaust my channel marker and advance. I am embarrassed to say how long it took me to realize that uh, your primal energy 
that the picture for it was not a honeycomb. Oh, yeah, it scales. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Would you like to know when I realized that? <laughs> uh, now? About 40 right minutes now? ago. Okay. <laughs> Graphic design is my passion. <laughs> okay, are you done, Jeremy? Yeah. Okay, so, um, Rujni is going to charge his uh, channel marker. He is also going to place this rose here. And he is going to put this on the sentient track. Yeah. Okay. I just want to like make sure I'm not calling. Okay. Now, what am I going to do with you? Is the question. Did I not fill this up? Clearly not. Did I really not? I don't think I did. You couldn't have because the yeah. top, you can't get rid of the top yet. Okay, that was my argument too, Daniel. So, okay, good. Because I'm like, what is happening? Um, okay, so I'm going to place this. And then, um... I will take... The one energy transmuter Let's tile. Go. Yep. That's the one. And that's obviously going to be it for me. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, what am I going to do? I'm going to use this. Advance this one. I'm going to use this to place this. This board is so pretty. Mm -hmm. Where am I going to place this? What is it? Rows. Yeah. Here. There's one here. Got one here. There's two, there's two there. here at the furnace. Yeah. Don't. Well. That's actually not that bad because I could get tokens instead of moving. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. And then I'm going to use this. Do I have to spend two? No, you could. It means you can buy up to two. Okay. They cost uh, the. It's indicated on top how much they cost. Yeah. So you're gonna have to spend three for that. Yep. And it's gonna replace this guy. Why would you replace that guy? Replace one of the two without a foot. Oh, right, I can replace what's... Yep, yep, I can replace it on the board. Um, that makes sense. That's the smart <laughs> mm -hmm. thing to do here. You always want to get rid of those basic basic ones yeah. first. Yep. Okay. Um. <laughs> He's wearing a balaclava. <laughs> I'm going to use my third slot here to place this rose here. You know, if you put it here on the forge, then you'll complete this one. Mm-hmm. 
I'm not saying that to tell you how to live your life. I just don't know if you can see that rose or not. No, yeah. Um, I know that. I know. Okay. Um, but thank you. Uh, yeah. Uh, I'm going to exhaust that to charge. There's a, there's a lot to manage. <laughs> yeah. Um, and that's going to do it for Ignotus. Okay. Um, originally, I was going to advance for two. And, uh, Maltinek is going to advance for one. Exciting stuff happening on this side of the table, let me tell you. Honey, I don't know how you're keeping up with this, to be honest with you. I have to say their name. Okay. <laughs> I have to say their name. Um, I go. Yep. Okay. Let me guess. Are you going to advance? I don't know. Man, do you have that channel marker charged? Mm mm. Uh. <laughs> or at least it doesn't look like no, it's charged. Um, it's about to be. Mm hmm. Uh, just thinking out loud here. Okay. All right, well, I am also advancing, but mine is charged, so I'm going to advance for two. What do we need out here? Roses, stones. Okay. Lots of compasses. I've heard that you have a lot of those in your hand. <laughs> no. Look how Jeremy did this. He literally... Did you look? I did not. I swear. I, I did you. not. Uh -huh. Daniel, how does it feel to have a cheater for a brother? It's not great. I always tried to tell my parents when he wanted that he cheated. They wouldn't listen to me. Did you do your turn? Okay. So back to originally. Let's do some exciting stuff with him this time. Uh, like. <laughs> I was like, what is he whispering at me? <laughs> Don't piss off the person that controls the cameras is all I'm saying. Hey. What? Um, I must have missed something. Okay. Um, also going to move up the transformative track here and that's going to be it for Rishni now homie here is going to charge his channel marker and that is it so <laughs> this looks like um what's the name of the guy in God of War Jeremy Kratos yeah or Thanos. He looks like uh, Kratos. I can see it. He also kind of looks like the uh, dwar the dwarf. The He's dwarf that was helping him out. Because he was blue. told to be a dwarf. Well, yeah, but if he was short, he would look like the dwarf that was helping him out. But if he was out. a dwarf, of course I love playing him. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I don't know where I recognize that guy from. It's an anime. Um, I forgot to resolve this. Okay. Let's do that Let's resolve first. away. Okay, so, Daniel, um, would you like, uh, like the rocks and, uh, rows? Mm. Or would you like to move forward <laughs> four? <laughs> yeah, one, two, three, four. No. Um, yeah, but I didn't put, well, it, I guess it doesn't matter. I didn't put mine down first. But. 
That's yeah, but these are both the, mine. Yeah, you're the only one so other than her that's one. getting an award. Um, award. And this yeah. lets you move on the Transformator track, the Sentient track, or move your avatar. Yes. Um, I get a rose and a what? Uh, the rocks. Rock and roll. Um, how many do I get to move? Oh, one. one. Just one. What's... This is an easy choice. You can't really move your bird. What's the bird up here mean? And ju it's just your symbol. It's uh, if you get to the top of that side. It's an either or though. It's a I yes. put one of these down or bird. You move your avatar or you place one of these. How many? One. Okay. Oh. Yeah. Okay. I made that way harder than it needed to be. You're welcome. <laughs> okay, so I uh, I am going to... Uh, Rujni is going to pull uh, Rose and a... Obviously, one of the rocks out of the library over here because all of them just about are over there. And then place a... <laughs> that there and then the rose is going to be bound do you want to swap to a side by side or like to the side mm -hmm. so this is the forge the forge is really rad oh, i don't see the number one they're numbered so that you can make sure to get them in the right place there we go one um so if you get to the top of that that's a pillar of civilization. Mm-hmm. Okay. But, well... No, the, the symbology is confusing, but no, you don't get to place one of those. If you look at the one right there that lets you place one, it's different than that. That's telling you that you... If you get to the top of this, you get to bind it to one of these without completing the monument. Okay. But this is a... One of these. Yeah. Okay. I mean... Either way is fine. I just <laughs> yeah, I know. Weird shape slash bird. Mm -hmm. I don't know hieroglyphics, so I was a little confused. <laughs> that one. I... Okay, so sorry, I moved us backwards, back forwards. Daniel, was it your turn, or did you finish your turn already? No, it's his turn. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I didn't. Or wait, no, you just finished with. Broccoli Man. No, I retroactively realized that he had completed a uh, furnace, and we didn't resolve it. Okay. It had already moved past Multinec. Okay, so it's Daniel's turn then. Okay. Yeah, I guess it doesn't specify that. That's okay. Alright. Um, I'm sorry, Chris. I know you put a lot of thought into the names of these things. I apologize for calling Rouge knee broccoli man. I think it's a term of endearment. <laughs> I think it's a term of endearment. I mean, I'm a bird, is all I'm saying. <laughs> I'm not one to judge. Um, that broccoli looks real tasty. Um, what am I going to do? And right on time, Dakota just started snoring. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. If you hear a noise in the background, it is a snoring dog. It's been a very exciting day here. We've had escapees. We've had squeaky toys. <laughs> Speaking of, where is the prison breaker? Yeah, we are going to okay. expand. She um, is passed out by the fireplace. Um, exhausted from her journeys. <laughs> Okay, that's all I got. Okay. All right. I am going to exhaust. Oh, before you do that, will you change the camera real fast? Oh, yes. Sorry, I know it's a lot. I'm going to start hitting them every time. We uh, I'm going to exhaust my number three to place both of these. Uh, will you put this on the fortress, please? Yes. 
Um, and I'll put this one here. Uh, and then I will exhaust this to charge. <laughs> and I will exhaust this guy to move on to that track. This game is about to get real, real good. Yeah, I'll exhaust it to make my dude move for two. That's what I will do. Okay. Okay, so resolving this, are you done? I am. Okay, so starting with uh, Rujni, um, opting to put a tile down. Mm hmm. And then the transformative one goes, allows me to move, yes? Yes. Okay, so I'm going to just bloop right there with that. All right. Man, that's a good tile. The reverse, the reverse side of my tile, number one, is not that good. <laughs> <laughs> okay, now moving on to Multinac. Uh, also opting to lay down... His tile. Is that what he wants to do? It is what he wants to do. And then the compass goes somewhere else, yes? Yep. There's one here. There's one on the forge. I think that's it currently. Okay, so I'm going to put that on the beacon. Um, okay, now, Jeremy, do you want a primal and a compass, or do you want to place a towel? I will be placing a towel. Okay. And then, behind, do you mind if I put this in? I do not. Go for okay. it. It's like the most awesome part. <laughs> Except for when you drop it. Okay, there we go. Hiya. Okay, uh, now that we're back at the bottom, can we take a five-minute break? Absolutely. We'll be right back. And we're back. And we are back. And it is Rujni's turn. It is indeed. He is going to advance one last time before he makes some... Some money moves. Um, also, um, I really hate to do this, but I'm doing it nonetheless, so I guess I don't hate it too bad. Uh, Multinec is going to do a double advance. Why do you hate to do that? Well, because I had an unused energy in there. Uh, it happens. But that is going to allow me. Let me make sure I'm not getting my guys mixed up here. Yes. Okay, so that is going to allow me to move up the track three. So then I have to get, I have to move up one more, right? Before I can put this on the board in a pillar of civilization. I'm in the fourth slot. Yes, you have to have one more uh, movement to actually put it on. Hiya. Okay, that I can do. <laughs> so excited. Okay, Daniel, it's your turn. We are going to advance. Um, 
keep this simple. I am also double advancing. Sweet. Hey, Jeremy, will you tell me um, what the missing energy from that one right there is? Rock. Paper, scissors. Okay, so Rujni is going to do this. Place this here. Going to do this. To place this here. Well, shoot. I'm gonna just place this here for safekeeping for now. Okay. Yeah. So can we resolve the mm -hmm. beacon? Uh, uh Multinek, do you want a towel or a primal energy? Mul one primal energy? Mm-hmm. Uh, that's definitely what he wants. <laughs> okay, and there are no there are no compasses apparently. Nope. So. Okay. Um, I'm assuming you want to take your primal energy back, not your compass. Correct. And then, what would Rujni like? Um, a Rujni would really like this. Okay. Boom. Tower's getting built. It is. It is. It's a beacon to the people. Okay. <laughs> is it stuck on there good? Yeah. Okay, so that was Rizmi's turn? Mm-hmm. Great. Uh, so now... I'm going to advance one. Boring. But that's going to be it for me. Okay, Crow. What you doing? We're going to advance. I need to hit the road, Jenny. Start moving around. That's what I'm going to do. I'm going to use my number four here to move one, two. Mm. Which is going to let me put another one of these down. Booyah. Um, and then I'm going to... Use my number one here to charge this guy again. And I'll do it. Okay. Uh, Rujni is going to advance. Okay. Um, now for, uh, Multinec, I'm about to do some stuff, so. He's got a lot of energy over there. <laughs> he does. He does. Not as well placed as it could be, but we'll see what we can do, right? Okay, so I'm going to exhaust this to put... This here, and then I 
forget to just place another one in there because of my special powers. Oh, okay. Yeah, and so now I'm gonna just do that. Okay. And I'm also going to uh, charge here. And um, fulfill my sentient track. So where do I put this? Is that columns or? Yes. Um, where are you currently? This is Multinec. He's in it purple. Is. So your only option this is right, right there. Yeah. Okay. That's what I'm going to do then. Now let's resolve this. Um... <laughs> Okay, so this just comes back as energy. Mm-hmm. This. Nothing happens with this. And then this gets bound into the fortress. And I'm going to put down a tile. Hmm. Hmm. How about that? Okay. That's going right. to be it for Multinec. Big turn for Multinec. Man, he's been building up to it for a hot second, huh? Mm hmm. Poor boats getting neglected. Not for much longer. Okay. Not for much longer at all. Mm. Although I need to like hit the road with both of my guys here. Mm hmm. This means if I do this one, I get to put both of these down, right? If I mm -hmm. use that? Yeah. Yep. So thought, okay. So we're going to do that. You exhaust one from here and here? Mm -hmm. Okay. <laughs> you got checkings. Well, I just Used didn't see. Sales. I didn't see the second one come out. That's why I asked. <laughs> um, they're, they're right here. Um, yeah. That's what I'm going to do. Um, all right. We're going to resolve that first. Okay. Are you ready to resolve it? Yeah. You're obviously placing a tile. I am placing a tile. I'm trying to decide. Well, I, this this needs to happen, so that's what we're gonna do. Um. Okay. I assume that you want to bind your um, compass. Yes. So then here are these back to you. And then... Um, and that doesn't... This doesn't take effect. Yeah, it does. Uh, so what does that do? I think you? it makes you move. Each time one of your primal energies is exhausted. Yeah, by two. Try forward and then up to two. So does that mean I get to move four? Yep, that's how I read that. Okay. I know I've placed this wrong, 
before, so I'm trying to get back to see where the... One, two, three, four. Am I landing on it? Mm-hmm. And this is, I get one of those, the upgrades for this, right? Mm-hmm. Okay, so let's do that. You also pressed over that so you can push yep. your other tile down. I gotta figure out where I'm gonna place. Ooh, that's a lot. Um, what is this? Uh, that lets you get one of these for no energy. Gain a transmuter tile. That's pretty good. That's pretty stinking good. A yeah, spot there. A yeah, spot there. Yeah. It just doesn't seem to want to bend. Surely not. Man, he sent me a picture of what it looks like, and we had put it on backwards, Lee, because I feel like it's supposed to go like this. Oh, yeah. Okay. But how do you make the magnet stick? I guess that's how. Okay. Man, I just didn't want to break it. It's such a pretty, it's such a pretty prototype. <laughs> <laughs> I completely miss, I completely miss what Daniel did with his turn. I'm sure it was brilliant. Yes, it was, as always. Um, but I need to look through the... Um... Upgraded action tokens? Yes. Oh, man, you're going to love these. Oh, my gosh. There's... Okay. <laughs> there, yeah, there's so you, many. There's eight, and there's they're different than the ones we played with last time, Daniel. You get different ones when you have um, more players. When you have four players. So you're welcome. That's. Oh, you get to do this plus charger thing. Yes. Ooh, that's. Pretty Isn't that rad? <laughs> oh, that's pretty stinking good. Um. Man, oh man. The choice is cool. That one's pretty good, but I feel like I want this guy. Do I? Might as well just put them here because you're about to get another one, and so am I. Right. I just have to plan for which one I think you're going to pick. I th actually, if I'm doing this like I'm supposed to... Too late, you're committed. You have to take that one now. <laughs> I don't even know what he has. I'm just trying to get him to pick one. I picked one. That's how it's going to be. Uh. <laughs> that's the one she wanted. <laughs> I, I want them all, so I mean that's this true, this is true. Um the we just set these aside. The yep. old ones. Okay. With your other discarded pieces. Okay. Um and your piece is constructed there. Mm. Yep. Now here. Um I obviously am going to take one of these. I'm going to take this one. Of course you will. Um, and then this will snap back here. Um, and this lets me move. Yes. For one. Indeed. Okay. I'm going to take this one because this is the only one that makes sense. <coughs> and let's build. Yeehaw. Do you want to put that on, Dean? Yeah. Sorry. 
the gate. Yeah. And to see what we've got going on here now. Okay. Comp well, one, one of each, basically. Remind me um, how energy gets here and it, how it's used again. Uh, there are different ways that you can put it there. Um, both of hers wound up there because there was the compass had to go somewhere and there wasn't anywhere for it to go. So it just goes here. You get one VP for it at the end. Yeah. And you couldn't put it on any of those. I no. could if I qualified. Yeah, she could oh, have I if she qualified. qualified but I don't that. think I did then. Or maybe I just didn't remember. Just um, but you can move it out of here. This this one right here, your number two. Um, instead of buying something, you can redistribute up to two energy from here to some to somewhere else on the board. Um, you can't you can't bind it to a monument, but you could like take it and move it to one of these. Um, you could put it or, on these? or yes, okay. you could do that. Or if you had one on a monument, you could also move it somewhere else with this if you wanted to. Yeah. Oh, okay. Um, okay, I am going to exhaust that and double advance. Fancy. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay, so Rujni is going to uh, just charge my token there. Do you have enough energy over there? <laughs> Not quite. <laughs> okay. And uh, Multinek is also going to advance one. <laughs> okay. Uh, and my new unlocked power is every time I advance, I get to fill up whatever started in slot one. Look at uh, look at your very oh, full right. device. Mm -hmm. Oh, okay. Cool. Um, okay. Uh, I'm advancing one. I should start building things. <laughs> I'm going to lose. Did both of yours go? Yeah. I, I just, oh, okay. Yeah. And then you advanced. advanced. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, it's time for Ignotus to do some stuff. Um, all right. Ignotus. More like it. We're going to exhaust this one. <laughs> which lets me put two of these out. Um, you put that on the fortress, please. Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of like she knew you did away with the doggy cam. <laughs> because now she just sits here and just is perfect the whole time. Yep. Yeah. The doggy cam has been repurposed to a table camera for tonight. Fair enough. It's also um, a little more challenging to do the puppy cam with the way we have the table set up now because I would move it when they would move. Mm -hmm. It's harder to, for others to remember to do that when they're busy running the game. And also <laughs> the camera is wired now, so it's... A lot harder. Uh, There's a Jeremy. What? I can't run games. That's all I'm saying. I know. I can't run them. My brain does not allow me to. Um, that was not a knock. <laughs> I'm going to exhaust my number three here again, and so I will put that on the fortress. Ooh. Uh, then I want to exhaust number one to charge this guy. And uh, 
I'm going to use my wild to copy my number one and place compass. Oh, you turd. Is there a compass up there? Nope. No. Oh, well, huh. I guess that decision has been made, huh? You're a whole turd. Um. Actually, no, I'm not going to do that. I'm going to use my wild to place my primal energy. Is what I'm going to do. Um, Better. <laughs> I think you should place the compass now. That's how you keep from sleeping on the couch tonight. I'm going to place that there. Um, and then I'm going to exhaust my number four here to move for one, two. Okay. And I'm going to get this guy for free. Amazing. I'm going to replace him. Um, and then I'm actually I'm going I'm just going all in. I'm going to exhaust You're this one. Clear that whole device. I am. Uh, to buy this. Go nuts, Jeremy. And replace this one. Okay. Are you done? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Okay, so which one do you want to bind? Uh, what have I got up there? Uh, a rose and the rocks. Um, let's bind the rose. Okay, so then this goes back onto your device as energy? It does. Thank you. And your choice is to put down a link token? Oh, I'm putting down a link token. Okay. Uh, the other option, just so you know, just so you're aware, the other option is to um, pull an energy of your choice. Okay. Out of the reserve. I'm definitely going to have to start getting some energy out of there, but I just, I realized like a turn and a half ago mm -hmm. that with this many players, mm -hmm. you could run out of spaces to put Link tokens. Isn't that crazy? And so I really want to get this last leak token out. Mm. Okay. Um, hmm. uh, what does my scoring thing do here? I can't look that up in here. Uh, I'm just going to place it, yeah. and I'll, I'll, I'll decide later which side I want that on. Okay. <laughs> um, that's my turn. All right, so coming back around to Rishni, uh, he is going to do a double advance. And really make some stuff happen on the next round. Okay. All right, now, uh, moving on to Maltinek. Uh I am going to launch these. And then also launch this I'm already up. <laughs> like you can just hand it to me, honey. Why would I do that? Why would I do that? And then I'm so I'm just gonna pick this guy right here up and I'm gonna just put him right there. Okay. That's it for him. Okay. Well I'm going to take oh. An upgrade. Yeah, I'm definitely going to take this one. Okay, 
and then I will take those. Uh, and this means I get to move one, yes. Ooh, uh, Rose? Yeah. This is for Molten Edge. Okay. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Which energy would you like to bind? What are my choices? Primal or Compass. Compass. Take that Primal Energy back. But now I get to move to there. Okay. Yeah. Okay. We're going to expand that to charge and play this rose and we'll play it here and then I'm going to expand this to play oh go ahead just I, I lined this up and didn't realize I did so <laughs> um I can't believe I missed this and that's what I'm going to do okay which one are you resolving first uh, well, that one's easy, so let's resolve it. Okay. How do I tell what these do again? They're in here. It's in uh, the big I'll look it up for you. Okay. Yeah. Please do, because... Oh, yeah. Jeremy, did you ever choose which one you were going to yeah. use? Okay. It's flipped the right way now. Um... I'm going to put it here. I just don't know which side. Uh, oh, oh no, no, that's bound no. here. Does that do I get to do oh, the yeah. primal thing if I bind it? Like the, the it special depends, no. It depends on what it, on what your thing is. Each time one of your primal energies is exhausted by a monument section. That's completion. not exhausted though, yeah. it's bound. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Um Score, okay, the one with a three times on it is score three VP for each of your bound energy in a pillar of civilization in the two adjacent regions. Eight. Um, Interesting. The one with an eight on it is if you have at least two bound energy in each adjacent region, then score eight VP. So I can't put any more of my link tokens down. There's one in here. Okay. So read that second one again. If you have at least two bound energy in each adjacent region. So I need another one here and two here. Yep, correct. Well, I'm about to have one here, so I need one more here and one more here. Mm -hmm. I can do that, I think. Um, okay. This you one. want me to put that back over here? Yeah. Who... Uh, who Went first here. Well, it'll be Jeremy. Oh, yeah. Because you completed it. Primal. Um, recharge a thingy, or you get a compass and a stone. I'm going to take a compass and a stone, please. Thank you. But that was my primal, so I also get to oh uh hand me a primal as well please oh yeah that's a good one yeah okay i um i will take um Oh boy. E okay, um, sorry, y'all. 
I I think I'll I think I'll do the same. It's a compass and a rock Is formation. Your this guy. And I was just about to put the greens down in here. <laughs> Compass Again, I don't know how you're keeping up with this, so... I have to say their names. So I've been trying to, like, mentally prepare. Daniel, I got a uh, Game of Thrones version of Arkham. Okay. It's a two-player game. It is competitive. <laughs> and I'm playing a solo. So mm. I am playing against myself. I have not played it yet because I'm trying to like mentally prepare for those gymnastics. The, this is, it, it goes yeah, it goes on the outside okay. on that one. Alright. Um and that binds and I'm gonna do the uh, stone and compass. Quick update of what the monuments are looking like. See? If they get built, <laughs> it looks pretty cool. Alright. Uh, stop me if you've heard this one before. I am exhausting and double advancing. What? Shocking. Shocking. Unheard of. But, that also lines up my uh, Disney World symbols, which will let me advance all the way up this, and I'm going to bind this in that fortress, please. Smart. Smart, smart, smart. Mm-hmm. Okay. So it's Rujani's turn now, yes? It is indeed. Okay. So. This board is so big. And then, um, position five, okay. So, mm, can I take that back? <laughs> no. I'm taking you, it back. You touched it, and it's. <laughs> No takesies, backsies. No takesies, backsies. What kind of outfit do you think we're running here? But I want to take these backsies. Okay. Man, that was good for Rishni. Okay. This is contractor work, really, when you think about it. <laughs> yeah. Is it? Because the humans are doing all the work. Okay. We're just stomping around and impressing well... them. <laughs> okay, so Rushni is going to move. I'll just say there are many forms of labor in the world. Two, three, four. It sounds like the humans should form a union. Who are you going to call? Um, deities are the ultimate capitalists, so... Oh, oh yeah. <laughs> Have you seen the churches in Texas? Um... Just really doesn't want to stand up there though. I think it's just going to take some. It's doing the best it can. It's causing some know. you. It's going to take some time. There. And it's also I'm not being as rough with it as I normally am with our stuff because it's not ours. And I'm terrified I'm going to break it. It's like holding a baby for the first time. Okay. So that was Rujni's turn. Rujni's done. 
Uh, I am advancing for two. Okay. Big turn time. Watch this. I. <laughs> but I'm also going to move for four because I line that up. One, two, three, four. And I'm going. This is for you. Oh, yeah. oh right. I forgot. I did that. Cool. I'm going to take this guy and replace. I don't like this guy. So let's do that. Okay. Oh, I guess I need to fill out my energy. Okay, question. Because this guy was already on the board as this guy and would have had that when I replaced it because I hit this after the advance do I, does something go in here or does this stay empty I think it would stay empty okay. I don't follow what's happening right now but if, if, Wendy, if Wendy said that it would stay empty, then your cheating is quite blatant. So It's Listen. not. Look, I can be a rules lawyer, and I can argue for the defense or for the prosecution on that one, but... I had a good argument. You did. No, I, I know exactly like where your head went there, Daniel, and, and it went to a very logical place. I'll accept the judgment. <clears throat> Sorry, buddy. Maybe if you were a better sport last time you kicked my ass on the list, then I wouldn't have been so quick to judgment there. Mm. <laughs> so it's personal now, I see. It's okay. It's Never okay. forget. <laughs> All right. I'm exhausting my number three, which lets me use two of these. So I'm going to shoot all of these off of here. Um, Okay. And then I'm going to exhaust my number four to move one. I can't see the other side of this tower. Is that, is that one to get from here to here? That is one. Two. Hello, Rujni. Oh, hello. And that lets you move up either track by two. Okay. So... We'll move up this one. Um, and then I will charge. And stop there. You're up, Broccoli Man. I mean, Broccoli Man's trying to decide what he's going to do. Oh my god. It's, it's... What? Broken Man is just a little unsure. Okay. Um... If I had a head full of broccoli, I'd be unsure. <laughs> so when I get here, into the second slot on my device here, mm -hmm. that is if I use that second motion I can pull a tile out of there and place it somewhere else yes yes except you, around. you can't bind it 
Yeah. But you could. I can do other stuff with you, it. You could put it on a monument. You could put it on one of these. Okay. In that case, uh, Rujni is just going to advance for one. And I think you can do that in the base one. You can do that with two. So you can do that twice. Yeah. Okay. There's a, there's an upgraded one in there somewhere that lets you do it with four. Yeah. All right, we're gonna do this here. Question. Mm hmm. Does being here count as entering a new region, or do I have to go from here to here? I think you have to actually. You have to go yeah. into a new region. Okay. All right, now, uh, Multinac, let's talk about what we're doing with you, my friend. But if you do that on your next turn, it will count. Right. Well, I went from here to here. Mm hmm. To here. Did you do all that in one turn? Yes. Because I got to move three plus one. So I went one, two, three, four. Then that counts, yeah. Yes. Okay. Yes. That means I get to replenish one of these. Okay. Okay, so multi-night. Compass, rose, rose, rock. So I can put them on a thing, too. A monument? Yeah. Totally. Thank you. The only thing you can't do is bind them or put them on one of these, I don't think. What was that one? I've forgotten now. You have bindings in three... Three different monuments? Okay. Yeah. Okay, and then also, uh, Rajni is going to place this here. And this faction means I get to do any of these ones. Yeah, you copy it, basically. Okay. You do it as if you're taking that action. Okay. All right, Multinic is done. So, uh, D, it's your turn. Okay. Um, and we are going to stone here. So I can, you've explained this like three times now, <laughs> I can <laughs> activate this mm -hmm. and it does what? You can reposition one of these or if you had something in here. Oh, so it's not to put something in there. It, it is be, not. Okay. Right. Okay. That's fine. Um, yeah, that's what I'm going to do is that, that's my turn. Um, so let's resolve that guy. 
Where are the upgrade tokens, honey? There you go. Mm. I'll take this one. Um, and since that is my primal energy, I will also take a rose, please. Thank you. Okay. Those or a rose? I don't have a rose. Um, okay. <laughs> I need some spleen in here. And just means it costs whatever's up here, right? So this is the same as what you got. You can do it twice. Or they all cost one? Yes. Ooh, that's what I want. Um... This one will let you reposition four times. Yeah, we're good. <laughs> okay. Uh, this is a primal, which is exhausted, because I'm not buying it. Yes, it is. Meaning I get to do my thing? If you have a thing that happens when you exhaust a yes. uh, primal, then yes. So you may move your avatar forward two, plus one, Three. Um, and I entered a new region you again. Did. So I'm going to replenish this guy. And yeah, that's it. The gate's really coming along. Yes, it is. Almost there. Almost there. Um, okay. Uh, I'm double advancing. Okay. first oh it, it doesn't it goes okay yeah i keep thinking it's supposed to yeah, yeah. No, i know that's how we played it at first yep all right so this comes back and goes anywhere i want it to is a rock yes yes uh, yeah, it just fills up a slot on your device so let's to refill so oh I should no that's fine um You're up. For this, mm -hmm. I will take a rose and a primal, please. A rose and a primal? Because yep. he used his primal. Oh, right. I will also take a rose. And then bind a rose. You want the honors? No, go ahead. I know you like the boat. Everybody likes the boat. I question anyone who doesn't like the boat. I think I like the furnace best. The furnace is cool. Yeah. 
Okay, so that was Rizni, right? Sure. Okay, so now Mock Attack is going to advance. It's, uh, the cord, it has always done that. Okay, as long as it's not messing with the string. Yeah, I don't no, think it's it not. It doesn't. Um, the cord just is so sensitive. For, for the screen, yeah. That's right. Yeah, yeah. Oh. It is your turn now. Uh, okay. Wow, that was, okay. Um. Sorry. No, it was, I was, feel like I just literally just went um <laughs> there was a lot of advancing happening yeah. uh-huh. <laughs> oh boy um okay big big turn here um so you do have a, quite a full device over here we're going to exhaust this guy to activate this guy and put these guys out We'll hold on to you for a sec. We're going to exhaust this guy to put this guy out. And there's your bonus points. Mm-hmm. Um, bonus points. Oh, that thing. What do I need? What do I want? Goodness. Goodness. Four movement on that thing, too. Um, yeah, yeah, yes. Um, then we're going to exhaust <laughs> this guy. This is the biggest move of Daniel's life. To move two, one, two, enter the new region, plus one. So let's refill this. At the end of your turn, you get to do that. Okay. <laughs> Be that way. Um... I'm not going to use it I was again. like, there's no way he gets to, like, refill it and then immediately use it. No, 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 no. I, I, was, no, no, not, no, no, I was not no. intending that. See me um, flip over this table. <laughs> so it's like, I feel like so, there's no way they would let that slip through. <laughs> I expand one, and I can take one energy from anywhere. From, yes, active. It can't be exhausted energy. But I can yes. do that twice after spending just one of these? You can buy two of these. Yes. You have to spend the amount, the requisite energy. So Which is one energy. Right? Yes, yes. So you got the upgraded one, so all of these cost one. So right. yes. So I can take these two and buy two of these. Correct. Yes. Looking for it. What are we talking about? Um... Let's get some columns going here. I like columns. Columns are good. And, well, I might as well get one of these, right? If I do that, I should have got this, right? Let me change that. Not necessarily. It just depends if you want to take two actions or... Well, I want to balance it out. I'd have a lot of two on the bottoms if I did that. Um, Okay. And... Now, I get to refill. You know what? That works out better. Actually... (laughs) 
Thank you for that. Yeah. I appreciate that. That's nice. Good looking out. Um. <laughs> uh, okay. Although you might want to wait until you build, even, because you'll have more exhausted stuff. But up to you. What do you mean? You need to build your monument here. Yeah, but this goes... I can put this anywhere, right? Yes, you can. Like here, right? Yeah. Which makes more sense. It's two for every compass you have. I have or is it on the board? On the board. Yeah. That's what, does it count in here? No. Uh, okay. Yeah. No. That five makes more sense. Because I don't think I'll get to two <laughs> okay. considering all my compasses are over here anyways um, does this have to be different energy for this no no okay then that's what we're doing oh and I guess I need to either get any of these or refresh one of these Ooh, that's a tough call I mean, that's what I would do if I were you. Yeah, I'm going to get a compass. Okay. That was my turn. Right, I bet you moment. can't guess what I'm going to do next turn. It's a huge mystery. <laughs> you and your no uh, charged up device over here? Uh -huh. I've used this about three times since I charged that. Oof. So I just, it's... Uh, refill your thing now. Oh, right. It is the end of your turn. <laughs> Take your turn. Sometimes the hall monitor is good to have on your team. Yeah. I'm, I'm team hall monitor. Um, right, I'm going to exhaust my number three, which will let me put out all of these. Booyah. So, let's see. I was about to say, don't worry about what he's doing. I realized you were looking. This is oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, Did I find a primal? Yeah, will you put my rose up there, please? Sure. Wait. I've got one primal there, one primal here. There's a primal over there. How many primal are we supposed to have? Three? Four. Why am I missing a primal? What'd you do with that? Didn't eat it. You sure about that? Maybe it is only three. Look. Three. Charge okay. this. Ooh. All right. Thought I was losing my mind. I was not going to go through looking for another bound token bound card <laughs> um oh yeah okay so I'll exhaust this to move this too and then I'll exhaust this to move it again um and I will bind this right here. Nice. Okay. Um Okay. Up there. Yep, okay, so uh Multinac. And then uh, he is going to take a compass. Mm -mm. He is not going to take a compass. He is going to move for four. One, two, three, four. 
real hard. Choosing the uh, upgraded action token there. Okay. Uh, Daniel? I am going to move four. And a whole bunch more. Alright, so I get two plus one plus four. Okay. Alright, so one, two, three, four, one. Yoink. And I entered a region at the end of a turn of which your avatar has entered a region. You may replenish transmuter tile. Is yes, that... you have to wait until you return. So, okay, read that one more time, Daniel. At the end of a turn on which your avatar has entered a region, you may replenish a transmuter tile. But is that the end of your turn? I don't think that's the end of your turn. A turn. Say a turn or your turn? A turn. Yeah, it does. A turn. So, yeah. Okay. Yeah, you can replenish one. Or do I replenish two because I entered twice? At the end of a turn where your avatar enters a new region, yes, you entered two, but you entered... A new region. I'm just asking for a rules check to make sure. Daniel, I love you so much. <laughs> Someone here can appreciate I can, the question I think being the asked. Same thing. Yes, because I'm going to just try to take every single inch I can get. Jeremy, do you want a compass or do you want to move for? I want a compass, please. I imagine so. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Good job. This is very important to my strategy um, to understand. And this is my primal, so I'll take that last piece, please. The rock. Sure. Take it. So much energy. That's what this guy does. The way he moves. And I'll burn that there. Now you know and... how I was able to build all that crap last game. <laughs> thing yep all right honey all right uh Rajni is advancing what is going on here I'm like, where is that tile I just bought? It's right here in my other player's pile. Okay. Yes. Okay. All right. So that's Rujni's action. Ooh. Ooh. Okay. And now, um,. What's the next gonna go? Okay. There. Is that what we want to do? Hmm. Do Daniel. <laughs> that's, uh, that's a good question. Okay. Lord. Yeah. Okay. I will resolve this one first because I'm sitting here. Compass here. Ooh, it's so pretty. It's so pretty. 
when it comes together. Oh, whoops. We put it together the right way. Oh, I love it. Don't you think it's so pretty? I know that it's supposed to be a forge, but it looks like a candlelight service on Christmas Eve. <laughs> <laughs> I can see that. Yeah. And now... From this angle, it looks like a nose on the front. <laughs> okay. What is this? Uh, one of these. One, two, three, four. I'm like, this. Oh, you don't want this? Mm, I don't know if I'll have the energy for it, but I reckon we'll find out, huh? Okay. And then, all right, so that's that one. Why do I have this random? Because it came back to me. Mm -hmm. Okay. And then over there. Um. Uh, I don't have a rose to get, so I guess I'll take um, a column one. And this is for Moth's neck. What is the... It's... Those are a, a rose. Man. 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 I mean, he's got four in there. Might as well do this. That just won't fit no matter what I do. I know. Did you flip it over or sometimes that helps? Yeah, no, I tried. It just doesn't. <laughs> okay, you know what? It. I know what its intention is. Okay, and then I'm going to find this. Okay. This is coming home. Hi, hi, little Dakota. Okay, and now, Daniel, it is your turn. That is it for Mr. Montenegro. Well. <laughs> Slim Pickens! Yeah, game's almost over. It's about, I mean, we're not going to make it around to me another turn so I need to uh, I don't know there's no way it depends on like what's coming up cause like yeah. usually he's got a little bit up his sleeve but not too much and all Molten I can do is uh, advance yeah same here what does the sale need two compasses Right now there are three compasses and one rose in play. Yeah, I mean, I'm going to advance. I just don't think it's a smart play, but not much else. Plus I don't have energy to fill all these out. Well, I'm also advancing, but I'll end up here so I get to move this up the track. replenish a board if I had the energy also remember it has to go it has to go all the way around 
even if she were to end the game right now, everyone would still get one more turn. Mm-hmm. It has to be an equal number of turns. Now, <laughs> there would be no monuments for you to place anything on, but... Yeah. All right. Is it Rujni's turn? It is. Okay. Um, so... I don't know if y'all know what you just saw, but you just saw Rishni win. <laughs> Why have you got a lot of roses out there? Yeah. Okay, so, um, what is my option out there? Uh, for completing this, uh, the tile of your choice, or one of these guys. Okay, uh, yeah. I'm gonna take that, and then I am. So you're taking this. I am taking that. And binding this. Absolutely. All right. So now all that's left is the uh, sale. Mm-hmm. Okay. Man, and all all I can do is advance poor little molten neck over here. Okay, but that did just give me two of these. Okay, Daniel. Now, how, what are the ways I can get tokens over there? You have to use your movement guy over here. You've already, you've already got one here, so you can't put another one there. Sure. You need two pillars here, two orange dudes here, or purple. Sure. Uh, three energy and three different monuments and three of these things for that top one. Okay. And if I had any of those things, I would have to. You deploy it using your number two slot. Oh, okay. Right. Um. Yeah. Okay. Uh, yeah. So. I can't do that anyways. I don't have any of it or my number two. Uh, so I need to. What do I need to do? Oh. How do I get here? Is it one, two? Mm hmm. Okay, bear with me. Um, I'm going to activate this guy and we're going to put this just goes in here if I can't put it anywhere. Mm -hmm. Correct. Put that there. It's worth one victory point. If it stays there. Okay. And then... Unless you reposition it, what you can do with this. Where would I reposition it? Well, not on a monument, but over here. Oh. Interesting. But I can't because I don't have the things to put anything over there. 
Um, you don't meet any of these requirements? Hmm. Not at the moment. So. You don't have two columns or two purple things? No, he's got one of each. You bought so many of these. I thought for sure you had. He that. was lining feet. up those feet, baby. Okay. He, he leaned in. He well, you you got the feet one. In. He, he leaned into the traveler. Uh huh. As he should. I mean, he was in character. I want to make a joke, but we're streaming. And I don't want to label myself. Um. Okay. Is there gonna be a club foot reference? <laughs> Hi. Hello. We're trying to make a turn here. Hold on a second and I'll pay you. Um, okay, so that's done. Yep. Because I expended both of those to do all of that. Here's where things are going to get interesting. You can ch you can chunk them here if you got nowhere else to put them. They're worth one victory point apiece. It's better than nothing. What do you mean chunk them here? can't just move them. If you, if you use one of your things that lets you place, and there's nowhere for them to go, they go here. Oh, I, I see. Yes, I know you're there. Um, she's very anxious to get better. I have, I have an idea. So we're going to... Hi. Say hi, Art. We're going to... Spend this <laughs> to move. Still laying the scene as always. One. I have bad news. No one cares what you're doing. Two. Right now. Three. And I get to move two. One, two. And then I'm going to expand one more to put this over here. Good call. And then I'm going to uh, hey, right. I think you need to change that camera real quick. Which camera? I did. Everyone saw this. Ridiculous. I didn't see it. <laughs> goodness I see you. I can't miss you. You're so big and white and fluffy and in my face. Alright. Um, I'm going to also spend this to activate this to buy How many do I need? Two? Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. This and this. Daniel's turn will never end. Yeah, what are you doing? He's building up bonus points. And then we resolve this and I take the compass and put it here. Right? Sure. Yes. And this binds. Oh, sorry. What did you want to do? What did I want to do? You get a stone back. Yeah, I know. And you get a primal, or you get to uh, resolve, uh, fill up a, a thing. I'll fill up a thing. Why not? Go for it. Um, I'm going to take a primal. Because we want to get rid of all of them here. That's right. And the cell goes up. Beautiful. And. Oh my God, Daniel. Pause. No. No, there's nothing no. left. I can tell you there's nothing left. 
I entered a new region, so I get to fill up one of these. Doesn't matter. I'm doing it anyways. Okay. Congratulations. Yes. Enjoy your participation trophy. Um, I also get this. Oh, oh, oh my gosh. Go over here. Oh, oh. All right. Um, <laughs> it's her breast stinky. She's been eating lots of fish treats. Oh, oh. And mice. I want to yeah. activate this. Um, put this guy here. Hey, nobody cares what you're doing. Nobody cares what you're I doing. I know. Either. See? I do. It goes both ways. We'll go here. We'll I'm going to move this guy up we'll and here. place him. How many do I have here? I can't see. Oh, I had to cut I'm sorry. Um... And then yes. wound up. Put these here. She is currently sedated. Yep, all of these. All of these. If that makes him win. Um, <laughs> I don't qualify for anything else over here, so. Your turn's never going to be. Truly. I'm in the seventh circle of hell That's right it. now. <laughs> Excuse me. I did mine in two minutes, if that. I had a lot of things I had to accomplish in my turn. Oh, okay. So, that concludes. And now we add up scores. Yes. Alright. Uh, fully gained energy. Okay, so Jeremy, that's four for you, yes? Yes, 15 victory points. And then, so for Daniel, that's three. Ten. And then for two? For two is six, and for one is three. Okay, what's next? Monuments. Mm-hmm. Um, so... Let's it, just take them one at a time. You want uh, to start with the fortress? Sure. Uh, not, I keep wanting to say you. Moltenek has one. So that's three. It's three victory points. Daniel has two. So that's seven. I have three for twelve. Okay. Rujni has zero. Rujni then... has zero. Okay. Uh... The tower in the middle here. That sucks. Rujni, the beacon. The beacon. Rujni and Multinek both have two, so seven apiece. Okay. The portal you can see better than I can. Okay, so you have three. So twelve. So we twelve for Jeremy. Oh my God, Daniel! Please be still. <laughs> Okay, Daniel has two, so that's seven. Mm -hmm. And then uh, Multinek has one, so that's three. Okay. Okay. Last time. Uh, Forge. Rujini has three, 12. Multinek has one, so three. And I have one, so three. Okay. Ship, Daniel has three for twelve. And Rujni has one for three. Okay. Fourteen. None of these pens work. God, bless you. 
Plaza America. Hark. Okay. So Jeremy is out with a strong lead right now. Uh, well, I'm not going to get any for this one. Pillars of Civilization. I think you each have one, right? Mm -hmm. Multinek has one. Multinek has one for three points. Daniel has one for three points. Ooh, that's going to put us ahead. Tell you what. Hey, if you get enough of these, it's worth a ton. 38 points. Yeah, for six of them. Uh, tier 3 link tokens. Okay. 8 points. You got yours, right? Yep. So 8. Uh, did you have yours down? No. Uh, oh, really? They're full. Oh, well, there's one here. Yeah, but I gave up on that shit because okay. it was too late. Yeah, she would have had to get all the way over here or all the way over there to trigger it. Yeah. Because there's no other way to do it. Yeah. Um, I got mine, so ten for mine. You did. Uh, achievements. Uh, Multinec has a total of ten. So does... Orion. Um, and Rujini, how many roses does Rujini have bound? Several. One, two, three, three. Three. Plus this one, so four. Four times two. Um... And for me, uh, compasses, one, two, three. Um, I think you've got three on that one, Jeremy. Three compasses here. Is mm -hmm. the one on the right a compass or like yes. the one on this side? Yeah, these are both compasses. Okay. So four compasses mm -hmm. plus this one, so five. So 15. Oh, ten? Ten. <laughs> Does that make you nervous that I'm the one to keep a score? <laughs> Not really. Dimensional corridor, uh, each one there is worth one point. Uh, so okay. one for Orion, one for Rujni, five <laughs> for Ignotus. It's just wrong. It's so wrong. You left me with nowhere else to put them. He just said that was your fault, Daniel. Ooh. So I think what we've learned here is Dragon's strong. You know? Dragon gets a lot of stuff on the board, is all I'm saying. That primal bonus is pretty mm -hmm. dang good. Okay, so... Uh, so does Multinex, though, really. Yep. Um, I wish I would have leaned into it a little better. All right, so coming in at fourth is uh, Multinex. Coming in at third is Rujni. Coming in at second is uh, Ariane. And coming in at a very strong first is Ignatus. I always lose this game, and I just can't wait to play it again. So, what does that say? <laughs> what does that I mean, say? You were you gave yourself a handicap. You might as well have been doing this backwards with a blindfold. No, I like playing with two. Okay. I actually like playing with two. Yeah, technically, you could. It gave me something to think about while y'all were taking forever to do your turns. Okay. You, you could lean into, if you're just looking to win, you could no. potentially... That, Lean Daniel, let me tell you something. It came up several times, and it's like, 
nobody will know. Nobody will know. I've tried to justify it to myself. I can't do that, but I thought about it. Well, you used the first one to set up a whole bunch to be completed by the second one. Yeah, I know, but like... I should have... I, I, I would have done it. I can't... I yeah, we all more. know you would have done it. Yes. No one here is surprised by that. I just... My moral compass was like, now, now, now. <laughs> Okay. My winning right. compass is like, yes, uh, yes, Let's yes. go look at the finished product. Very nice. Mm-hmm. So this game is coming out on Kickstarter or for crowdfunding in February. Or March. Late winter <laughs> of 23. Um, we, we brought this home from Shucks with us and have been playing it almost every day since we put it on the table the first time and I will say that this is definitely a game that we will be backing if you're into heavy euros because there is a lot of rules that go into this agree with that Mm -hmm. boys okay Mm -hmm. um but for me personally I really love the mechanics it causes you to think in lots of different directions at once um which Sometimes works really well for me and sometimes not as well for me. But like once you get in that zone of what you're trying to do, I feel like this game is just absolutely brilliant. Yeah. Um, yeah. It's a lot of fun. Uh, you have to be prepared to put in the time commitment to learn everything. Um, mm-hmm. e- even more than some euros, a lot of... B- because there's not a real world theme connecting it sure um i think of like brass or uh great western trail which have rules every bit as complex if not more so but they're a little easier to grok the iconography especially because they relate to real world things um but you can get over that hump i f- like i feel like at this point we played it enough that it just goes and yes. so if you're willing to put in that commitment to it it is it is fun and it plays pretty smoothly and cl- quickly once you do get over that hump so um except for my turns yes except for daniel's turns but that's going to be the case no matter what so with all hendersons um except for me <laughs> mm-hmm um and i came in last and next to last so maybe that says something about that <laughs> All right, so um, this has been an age contrived, Mm -hmm. uh, a game. um, This is a prototype from Bellows Intent, like we said at the top here. There's a dog playing with her tail under the table. Mm -hmm. Um, Go to their website, uh, check out their social stuff. There's lots of great photography of this game because it's absolutely beautiful. Um, and look for that crowdfunding campaign to start. <laughs> look for that crowdfunding campaign to start in winter of next year. Anything okay. you want to add? I don't think so. Uh, fun game. <laughs> uh, we will be putting up a, a preview uh, video as well sure. over on our YouTube channel. Um, in, in case you were watching this and confused by the rules or anything that was happening. Um, yeah, we purposefully chose not to do a teach in our stream tonight because yeah. it's a school night, um, <laughs> and that would just extend this even longer than it already has. So we uh, we will get that up on our YouTube channel, though. Um, and we have gotten about as much quiet time as we're going to, it would appear, for one night. So <laughs> um, if you like this stuff... Uh, We've got more, both here on our YouTube channel. Um, Go to our website, elevation.games, sign up for our newsletter. Um, It is spooky season. We're getting some spooky season um, content up. Uh, Spooky like this. Uh, So... (laughs) I cannot wait for Daniel to get a dog. I'm going to just wind it up. Uh (laughs) Uh, Subscribe. Come back here if you like it. Um, Yeah. And we'll see you all later. All right. Bye, everybody. Bye.